Hey, what's happening everyone? Welcome back to another Breath of the Wild episode. Now, today's video is mainly going to be focused on shrine farming. As noted in previous videos, my main goal is to try and get the Master Sword before we actually go and hit up our fourth and final Divine Beast. However, before we actually go out of our way to find these shrines, there is a memory photo before us, and what better way to start off the video with this beautiful landscape. Let us see what secrets are hidden away in this memory. Be sure to take the time to soothe your mount. That's the only way you'll know how you truly feel. Your advice was quite helpful, thank you. And this little one and I are getting along quite well now. At first, I wasn't sure if I should outfit him with all of the royal gear. I thought maybe he should have to earn it first. But it works. He wears it like a true natural. I'm trying to be a bit more empathetic. Benefit of the doubt, you know? See that mountain? That's Mount Lanero. It takes its name from the goddess of wisdom. Lanero's decree is very specific. It says no one is allowed under the age of 17. For only the wise are permitted a place upon the mountain. I've prayed at the spring of courage and at the spring of power, yet neither awoke anything inside me. But maybe up there, perhaps the spring of wisdom, the final of the three, will be the one. To be honest, I have no real reason to think that will be the case. But there's always the chance that the next moment will change everything. Tomorrow is my 17th birthday. So then I shall go and make my way up the mountain. A bunch of little kids trying to save the world. What in God's name is going on? fuck is that? Who's this? Who are you? Oh, great. Okay, you need to fuck off. Uh, oh, yeah, okay, well, problem solved. Uh, not fucking with you guys. Let me see... Who are you? Uh, oh, you're a bird man. You're a bird! Oh, Kaz, yeah, right, from the, uh, stable. Um... I know, you're a hardcore musician. Mm. Uh, nah, I'm good. Uh. <laughs> I appreciate the uh, music though, man. Keep on being you, bitch! Birds! <laughs> Randomly somehow got a hold of a horse by accident, but I am not complaining. It made life easier. Um, where's this? Oh, okay, here it is. That's that's a weird place to have it. Okay. Seriously, who the fuck puts us down here? Zalta Wa. I wonder if these are named after each of these individuals. If that's the case, Zalta, you're an idiot. Hmm, 
Okay, switch to my left and uh, not on the fucking right. Mmm, Zalto Wa Trials. Two orbs to guide you. Okay, well, great, that didn't do fucking shit. Um, what is this? Gonna... Oh. Okay, that's not. It doesn't look like it's worth it right now. I don't think this is. I don't think I can magnetize this. Get rid of this. Oh fuck. Uh oh. Okay, no. Never mind. That worked. Grab this. Thank you. I think I can reach it. Right? You should be able to. Yeah. Okay. We're good. What's that gonna do? Oh. Okay. Right. It said two orbs. So where the fuck, can I just drop it on the switch? Is that a thing? Is that, oh, it's not heavy enough, all right. Oh, okay, all right. Mm, good, sweet. I can just get off that, right? What the, uh, okay, that's uh, visually inappropriate. <laughs> All right, so the next shrine that I found is actually inside this hill. It's just a little northwest of uh, the Quarry Ruins, so west of Hyrule Castle itself. What you're going to have to do is get on the mountain across the river and float over. As you can see, there's just a bunch of vines. So, Noya Niha. Noya Niha Trials. Looks like I'm gonna fight something again, so a minor test of strength. Wasn't there something else similar to that? I'm gonna keep this on me. Hopefully I can upgrade the sword that I have too, because it's actually really good sitting at 50. So, you look kind of basic.
I went ahead and reached the top of this tower up in this region here. It is a pain in the butt to get to. It's surrounded by water and all the enemies around do electricity based attacks. I wonder if I can... Here's our next shrine. Just a little northwest of central Hyrule. Monya Toma, Let's see what you got. Thunderblade, you're actually super handy, so. Do this, let that rotate. Drop this down again, because I need to blow those up. On our way to check out another memory photo. There we are. one. Oh, and another. The flowers we have in Hyrule aren't just beautiful. They're also quite useful as ingredients for a variety of things. <gasps> this one here is called the Silent Princess. It's a rare, endangered species. Despite our efforts, we can't get them to grow domestically yet. The princess can only thrive out here. In the wild. All that we can hope is that the species will be strong enough to prosper on its own. <gasps> is that what I think it is? Look at this. I don't believe it, but I actually caught one. This delicacy is known to have very, very potent effects under the proper circumstances. Ta-da! <laughs> Research from the castle shows ingesting one of these can actually augment certain abilities. We wouldn't be in a controlled environment out here, but with your level of physical fitness, you'd be a perfect candidate for the study. Go on. Mm. Taste it. <laughs> so 
So from my understanding, Zelda was also a psycho. That's fantastic. <laughs> Christ. Also, there's the location on the map, just in case, for those who are wondering. Here's our next shrine, pretty far up north. So probably recommend getting something to keep you warm. Shagema Trials. Two chests, this thing, shift and lock. Okay. Alright, here's our second shrine up north. Rin Oya Trials. One should be enough. So finally back in Charted Area, west of Hyrule Castle, here is another shrine. Shea Loya Trials. Okay.
unintentionally came across this prick. You can die. So within Rito City, or around the region, there are two shrines. I am, however, not going to be talking to anyone, just in case uh, it involves the Divine Beast. Speak of the devil, unfortunately, I cannot skip this uh, clip. <laughs> Aquaco trials. Looks like there's a hell of a lot in here, so let's see if I can stop any of these turbines. There's a way up. Here's a chest. Okay, well, that was simple. So this is the layout you want to have in case you are stuck. Just make sure most of the outside ones, or the three that are on the corner, are covering the outside layers. The other ones in the middle should be focused on, of course, whatever's in the middle. So. Guys never quit. <laughs> what is this? Found the shrine at the end of the world. Muo Jim. This one's located literally in the southeast corner. There's also another one just at the bottom over here. So let us go ahead and get these two out of the way. Trials. 
Time to fight another guardian. Here we are at the lower shrine. Chaz Keta. Chaz Keta trial, another combat one. Thought I was done. That's new. I'll take it. I'm back out in the Gerudo Desert, and as you can see, um, there is a pedestal right here with an orb, but the only way you're allowed to actually touch like the pedestal and the orb itself is you have to perform a race and beat the time, uh, which is a hundred, or sorry, a minute and 30 seconds, geez, a hundred minutes. And uh, yeah, once you beat that, you get a chance to pick up the orb, or you're at least allowed to pick up the orb, and this shrine right here will pop up. It's pretty easy, the race, so go ahead, give it a try, and it's an easy shrine. All right. Looks like Raka Zinzo's trials are... Oh, it says you've already proven yourself worthy. Interesting. Alright, so I made my way back to Goron City uh, just to reach the shrine and exchange it for some heart containers. So I should have enough. 
for three in total. Okay, so this seems like a good spot to actually end the episode. We finally, finally exchanged our spirit orbs for more heart containers, and hopefully this is enough. Next time, our first stop is Kurok Forest to grab the Master Sword and finally go ahead and take down our last Divine Beast. I cannot wait. If you guys liked the video, hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and of course, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Keep on gaming, folks. See you then.